Hey, welcome to the Yugaman channel. And if you're new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications. A former WWE superstar broadly passed on on Saturday due to a lung issue. And it's been very, very sad news for the wrestling lovers around the world. Hey, welcome to this channel. And don't forget to like this video. Now, the former WWE Intercontinental Champion died on Saturday after battling a non-COVID-related lung issue, his family announced. Broadley was only 41 years old. And Broadley was actually also known as Luke Humper, the guy that was part of the Wyatt family in the WWE Superstars. Now, these guys made a very, very big name, but hey, in this video, I want to focus on what has been said about Broadley and what statement his wife actually has given out as regards the thing that was going on in Broadley's life. So, Lee, whose real name is John Harbour, was a superstar with WWE from 2012 to 2019 before jumping over to the All Elite wrestlers that is the AEW in 2020 and was a fan of the favorite in both organizations and definitely people loved him in AEW and WWE so what exactly happened Luke Humper or broadly got an issue with his lungs um, this year and he was you know he suspended his participation in the AEW and definitely I think he had known that he had issues and so he decided to go and seek medication but on Saturday 26th December he was pronounced dead in Florida at the Mayo Clinic and his wife came out to say um, the organization where he's been working from, the AEW, has been very, very supportive. And some of his friends have actually come out to give very touching remarks. Um, one of them is Cody Rhodes. Now, Cody Rhodes came out and wrote a very, very touching message, which I want to read to you guys. But hey, if you're one of those people that loves wrestling, you cannot forget these superstars. These guys were bad, bad guys. They had a team that would actually surpass any other team in WWE. And every time you would watch them, you would think they have magic. So it's such a tragic, tragic death that many fans around the world must be heartbroken right now. But let me read to you what Cod Rhodes put down in one of his statements. So he started by saying, broadly, born 1979, and died in 2020. My heart is stricken by the loss of Broadley. It was obvious he was an extremely gifted athlete and storyteller. His gift beyond that was to challenge you and to set the bar very high. Upon anybody's meeting with him, it was even more apparent that he was a family man and first class human being. I got to share his last number. I got to have his last match. That is an honor and a privilege and an experience to ferociously humbling. Thank you, Big Rig. We will honor you and your family, Cody Rhodes. So that's the post. So Broadley's wife also came out to give a statement and it was also a very, very touching statement. Now Broadley and Amanda uh, married way back in 2008 and had uh, two children together. Now the statement that she put out um, read as follows. My heart is broken. Hubbard's wife or Broadley's wife, uh, wife Amanda said in a statement, he was my best friend, my husband the greatest father you would ever meet. The world saw him as the amazing Broadley, formerly known as Luke Harper, but was my best friend, my husband, and the greatest father you would ever meet. Amanda has credited the leadership at the All Elite Wrestlers, uh, that is the AEW, with helping her through this tough time. And the organization has since issued a statement saying the All Elite wrestling family is heartbroken by Broadley's death. In an industry filled with good people, 
John Haber, or broadly, was exceptionally respected and beloved in every way. A fierce and captivating talent, a thoughtful mentor, simply very kind, a, a very kind soul that starkly contradicted his persona as Mr. Broadly. WWE Hocho Triple H also weighed in saying, an amazing talent, better human being, husband and father. Also Matt Hardy, who is, a form, who is a WWE superstar, went ahead to say, I am shattered over Brody's passing. He was, a full, he was full of life with a wife, young children that he loved very much. A devastating reminder of how fragile life is. Rest well, my friend. That was uh, Matt Hardy. Um, Broadly first became a star with the WWE as Luke Harper and a member of the Wyatt family and won the NXT and WWE SmackDown Tag Team Championships. He left the Wyatt family in 2014 and wrestled Dolph Ziggler for the Intercontinental Belt, but Ziggler won it back in a very, very short time. In the years that followed, Broadly rejoined the Wyatt family and also formed a tag team, Bulldogian Brothers, with Eric Roman. Once Haber left, or once Broadly left the WWE and signed with the AEW, he won the AEW TNT Championship and held it for 46 before losing it to a match that aired on October 7th. After that, Lee took leave in absence because he had actually discovered that he has he had got an issue with his lungs. So that is broadly for you. He was a superstar loved by so many people and I know for some of you that actually watched his matches, you guys must have enjoyed all his wonderful, wonderful um, you know, participation, the energy, the characters that he created. And definitely we would want to say RIP broadly RIP Luke Harper. Thank you guys for watching and make sure that you subscribe and also turn on the notifications. Cheers.